name is Leonora Friday. I am from West Africa, Sierra Leone. I grew up with my dad and my great grandmother. My mother was not always home because of work. And when she was home, she really gave my brother and I any affection, which caused a strain in our relationship. I credited my great grandmother as the reason I become the strong and resilient woman I am today. When my brother and I migrated to the U.S. to start high school, it was a huge cultural shock for us. This was my first experience with bullying, which led me to feeling like I was an outcast. I even got into a fight where I picked up a chair and hit a ball. That was definitely not something my great grandmother taught me or would approve of me doing. But that experience and encouragement from my guidance counselor to push forward led me to make a decision to focus on my education and make something out of myself. So I was proud to graduate with my high school diploma and even went on to receiving an associate degree in Appliance of Science and Human Services. After a co-worker shared her story of incarceration with me, I was shocked that she confided in me with this part of her life. The advice to her was that if she wants a different life for herself, she must change her current way of life, such as her environment and her friends. Her story and life leads me to believe that as people, especially minority, we can change the negative narrative caused by discrimination, racism, and unfair criminal justice and make it work in our best interest. I was so glad I was introduced to the LOMS program because it has helped me realize my goal to uplift and motivate my community by introducing programs and services to people that may not know they exist. I thank and appreciate Ms. Carter for bringing this program to me. I love her tireless passion to aid people in need. The sisterhood that has been formed here like no other. I have found my voice and I'm so excited to see what the future holds for me. And my two beautiful children I raised with more love and opportunity than I ever had. So with that said, don't be afraid to invest in yourself. Love yourself unconditionally. The sky is the ultimate limit for you. So don't forget to fly like a butterfly. Thank you so much for supporting me in this journey. I hope to always be a role model to my children, my family, my community, and an example of how your life can change for the better by just being true to yourself, being authentic and real with yourself. Thank you so much for this opportunity. God bless.